Welp, here we are. FCS week number five. Don't worry, I got it right this time. Week number five. It's over. We're finished. We're halfway through the season. I know, right? Halfway through the regular season. Crazy stuff right there, right? Yeah. Um, so Jackson State's now ranked. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Not going to lie. Um, yeah, they played Mississippi Valley State, the worst team in the FCS yesterday. Uh, yeah, they beat them pretty handily. And now they're ranked. Um, I'm still kind of skeptical on Jackson State, but what they're doing is nice. What they're doing is nice. It's living up to the expectations that people are having for the Tigers this year and going in the next year. The expectations are... Hey, but keep an eye on Murray State and Jacksonville State, all right? These are two pretty good teams, you know, in the OVC, I believe. I don't know when they play, but if they, whenever they play, um, it's going to be interesting as all hell when they do play both these teams. Um, so that's going to be fun. Both, both of them won yesterday. Tarleton State got the best of Dixie State this time, so that's cool, you know, because they played the first time and Dixie State beat up on Tarleton State the second time now. Tarleton's got you know, Dixie State, and they beat them up. Wow, crazy stuff there. Um, Eastern Washington, Idaho State was wild yesterday. I, I really, I honestly didn't get really too much of a chance aside from the Jackson State game yesterday to watch any games because I was like, where, where are the streams at? Where are the games at? You know, and once again, we got let down by Sports Surge and and, and the streamers. So. So th this happens like every other week for some reason. Like why? I don't know why, but whatever. <laughs> um, North Dakota State still winning. You know, same old, same old. Weber State. You know, they struggling against UC Davis. I don't think Weber State should be number one, but they are. For but some people have rated them number one. Some people have rated Jackson. Um, not Jackson. I mean James Madison number one. You know. Uh, oh, yeah. Let me talk about James Madison real quick. If they're even on schedule for this week, um, yeah. I mean, not Jackson. I keep saying Jacksonville State. I meant James Madison. They're not even. They didn't even play this week. James Madison didn't play this week at all. But um, here's a real, here's a real questionable thing. You know. Uh, how about that Sam Houston nickel score, right? I mean, good lord. Good lord. 71 to 17. What a rough score right there. You know, Nichols just got absolutely whooped. They got beat down. They got whooped. And it wasn't even close. It was not even remotely close. North Dakota, who I think is number one in the country, you know, they are still getting W's out here. You know, and they easily took care of business. And, you know, there's a lot of big matchups coming up next Saturday and Sunday. Mostly next Saturday. There's two big ones, Chattanooga and Furman. Both of those teams are ranked. Uh, but I'll talk about those when we get to that point on Friday afternoon. And also North Dakota, North Dakota State. Going to be one hell of a matchup there. For the rest of the teams, the FCS it is going to be a weird, weird time to get to the finish line because once April hits, we are on the swing to the postseason. It is going to be one hell of a time. It is going to be the funnest time of the year, boys. You know, the FCS playoffs are the best time of the year. You know, for college football fans, no matter what, no matter what you think, I don't. I don't think bowl season is really the, the thing it should be anymore. I think bowl season is absolutely garbage. We should be going to a bigger playoff soon. It it just it, it works for the FCS. It works for every other division of college football. But the fact that you know the FBS this isn't even really about the FBS right now. This is about the FCS, you know. 
but I do wonder, you know, some things that we have to keep our eyes on. I do wonder is, you know, is the success for Jackson State going to be contained? Is that going to continue? And, uh, you know, what in the world is this conundrum with Weber State and James Madison? Because they haven't looked the best either. I mean, yeah, their rosters have been depleted. Yeah, you could say they're the best team in the country. But I think, you know, again, their old rosters are a bit depleted right now. I mean, especially now. I mean, a lot of teams' rosters do not look the best right now. But I don't think these two teams are necessarily the top two teams in the country. That honor goes to North Dakota. They have the best wins. And, um, yeah, just stick around for some of these other conferences, too, that are going to be looking real interesting. You know, the NEC, the Patriot League, you know, the Pioneer League, they started up, you know, this week. So San Diego's looking to repeat for, like, the sixth time, you know. For like the sixth straight year, they they won a con, they won the Pioneer League. Gonna be interesting, right? They're gonna be very interesting to see. But uh, yeah, that'll do it. Um, Y'all take care. I'm trying to get things together for this week, and yeah, y'all have a good day. I'll see you later.